third generation of my family to live in Wyoming, and I grew up in Worland. So I always wanted to live in other parts of the country and the world, but be able to come back to Wyoming. So um, Laramie is the best fit because it's, it's, it's Wyoming and it's our dear state with mountains and open spaces and hopefully lots of progressive ideas, um, yet it's not too big and it's not Denver. Well, I had a missed opportunity um, of going to Machu Picchu in Peru. So I uh, lived in Ecuador for nine months and I was a high school teacher. Uh, I taught English and um, there was a Peruvian-Ecuadorian uh, border boundary dispute between the Ecuadorians and the Peruvians. And so all the information we got from our Ecuadorian friends was like, don't go to Peru, don't do that. Yeah, so you should go to Colombia instead. So I never got to go to Machu Picchu, but I visited Colombia. One piece of advice that really sticks with me was from my dad, and he, his name is Ray. He's a plumber in Worland, and I was in college, and I had this boyfriend who I just was in love with, and I wanted to bring him back. You know, I went to college in Iowa, brought my boyfriend back to Worland, and, and I said, Dad, what do you think of him? You know, after the first day, I was almost like showing off a pet or something, you know, what do you think of him? And my dad, very gruff, you know, and. You know, Wyoming man says, Allie, it doesn't matter what I think of him. It matters what you think of him. It's your life. And I was so stunned because I was in my early 20s and I was looking for affirmation from my parents. What should I do with my life? And is this the right person? And he just flipped it to me. And it was really humbling and hard advice. Um, but I think it was necessary because it took me back a minute and I thought, oh yeah. It doesn't matter what anybody else thinks. Does it work with me in my life? And um, eventually we parted ways and I have, you know, wonderful different partner, husband. But I think that message from my dad was important. Mm -hmm.